Hey baby 5 math prodigies, it's Koi Saifu with your daily dose of math mastery and today we're going to go into question number 2 of your ratio math assessment paper. So let's take a look at the question immediately right now. The question says, Sue and Jean shed $250 in the ratio 11 is to 14. Find the difference in the amount of money that they received. So, Let's imagine this. Sue and Jean shed $250 in the ratio of 11 is to 40. I'm going to draw this out for you. So there's Sue on the left hand side. Okay. Sue. This is Sue. And then this is Jean. Okay. And the ratio that they have here is 11 is to what? 11 is to 15, no 14. Let's check again. 11 to 14. Yep, correct. And the amount they shared together is actually what? $250. $250. So, is it very obvious already? 11 units and 14 units gives you 250 units. In other words, 11 plus 14 gives you 25 units. Is the same as... $250. Mm, very, very easy already. So from here, all you have to do is just find the difference. The difference is actually what? 14 units minus 11 units will give you 3 units. 3 units times or whatever 1 unit is equal to will find you the answer. If you got, if you understood that, if you got it right, high five, you are a math prodigy. Good job. Okay, so now let's get to do it right now. Um, let's take um, $250 divided by, no, I'm going to cancel this first. I'm going to actually do the 11 units plus 14 units. So 11 units plus 14 units is going to give you 25 units. So now that we know it's 25 units, it's equals to how much? 25 units is equals to $250. Therefore, 1 unit is equals to $250 divided by 25. Very good. And so 1 unit is equal to $10. Okay. Now they're asking for the difference. The difference actually equals to, I'm going to use the blue marker right now. The difference is actually equals to 14 minus 11, which gives you 3 units. So 3 units is equal to $10 times 3, which gives you $30. So that means the difference is actually $30. So the, let's put in your statement here. The difference in the amount of money is $30. The difference in the amount of money... Bad handwriting here. <laughs> it's very difficult to write on this thing. Is $30. Alright? That's it. It's very, very simple. Again, ratio is all about units. So if you can understand that this is the units, 11 parts and 14 units parts, it goes to 25 units, which is $250. You understand everything already. That's all there is to ratio. All right. If you got it right, high five. You are a math prodigy. Good job. And I want to leave you again with the quote of the week, which is believe in you. You already know how to do these things. You've been learning this for the past five years. So believe in you and you will be able to make sure you get your A stars and your A's in the next exam. With that, this is Coach Saiful believing in you saying you are a math prodigy. Good job.